Hey, this is Dennis. We're reviewing RIS-1 3D Printer. You need to do more iterations faster than ever to stay competitive. The RIS-1 Zero post-processing 3D printer enables you to produce parts up to 100% faster than other systems and cut costs by more than 50%. Considering the number of parts you produce per month, the number of iterations per part, and the duration of each iteration, this new capability has a positive impact on total R&D, process time, cost, and designs. Gone are the messy and toxic post-processing materials, the special hookups, the space requirements for post-processing devices, and disposal. Most important, the hours of expensive labor requires you to deal with all of it. Finally, you can produce industrial class parts in the lab or or on demand, right in your own office, quickly, safely, and affordably. Great savings, great ROI. Welcome to a tour of the RISE-1 Industrial Class Office 3D Printer. RISE-1 is the only industrial class 3D printer that can exist as comfortably and safely in an office as it can in an additive manufacturing lab to produce manufacturing parts 100% faster and 50% less expensively than comparable systems. It's just 21 by 36 by 25 inches and weighs only 135 pounds, easily carried by just two people. The gullwing door uniquely gives you full visibility of your parts at every phase of the build, from start to finish. It also enables you to easily access the interior of the printer while sitting at your desk or standing. The printer can connect via USB or Ethernet. RISE-1 includes a high-resolution touchscreen for easy and convenient control, operation, and monitoring of your print jobs. You can select your print job, see its status, check your supplies, see the logs, network configuration, and so much more. If you open the door on the left front side of the machine, you'll see that RISE-1 is a dual filament spool capability with automatic hot swap. This eliminates running out of material during a long build, as well as unfinished spools on your shelf. Just to the right of the spools is the waste tray, which you can remove, empty, and replace quickly and easily. Inside the small door on the right front side of the printer, you'll find the ink cartridges that can very easily and quickly be removed and replaced. Our augmented polymer deposition technology calls for inks to be jetted from industrial printheads that can change the material properties of the thermoplastic at the voxel level. In this machine, RISE-1, it enables our unique zero-post processing and color capabilities. Just under the ink cartridges is the ink waste disposal. Note that it is solid waste for easy, clean disposal. Now let's take a look at the inside of RISE-1. The 12 by 8 by 6 inch build plate accommodates 80% of industrial parts. Removing and installing the build plate is very fast and easy. The carriage houses the extruder and the print heads. The extruder extrudes our own compound of engineering and medical grade thermoplastic. As mentioned earlier, the printhead jets inks that change the properties of the thermoplastic at the voxel level. Each printhead contains two channels. In RISE-1, one, one channel is for release one, for easy support removal, and the other is for marking ink, for detailed text and images. Tucked inside on the left side is the extruder cleaning station and the brains for the hot swap capability. Over on the right side, you'll find the printhead cleaning station, now that you're familiar with the mechanics, here's how RISE-1, powered by our patented APD technology, works. APD involves a simultaneous extrusion of medical and engineering grade thermoplastic and jetting of special inks. The thermoplastic is extruded, forming the support. Release ink is jetted between the support and the first layer of the part. Then thermoplastic is extruded, forming the part layers. Special inks are jetted between the layers of thermoplastic to change the material properties by voxel. I hope you enjoyed your tour of RISE-1. Be sure to learn more by visiting us on our website at www.rise3d.com.
For more 3D printing reviews from Dennis, please subscribe to this channel and or sign up for our newsletter. Links are in the description box below. Once again, thanks for joining us and have a great day.